did it and guess what you guys I'm done my closet but guess what I've decided to call it I've decided to call it my dressing room and you see who else loves it my little wonderful Mr. Mason so it's all done and I wanted to show it to you all I had such a great time doing this and so much fun so come on along for the tour as I show you all what I've done in my dressing room to my dressing room guys come on in I'm gonna take you on a tour of my dressing room that I built with these hands all by myself and that was my choice because I wanted to be proud of this room that I built it all by myself so let's start at the very beginning I have Miss Mavis here she's the keeper of my dressing room I love her love her um, I got her from home goods I'm um, just on a whim. She was, I was walking out the door and she was there, so I had to get her. So I love her. I think she's really cute. So got that from Home Goods. Here are some pictures that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. I thought they were really nice and sleek. Um, so I wanted to put those as we come in. So come on, come on in, come on in. So I'm gonna go around the room and show you all what I have here. This is the IKEA pack system. Um, they have like three different sizes and I have two of the sizes in this closet. Um, this is the 39 inch here and here I have my, all my shirts and my skirts and my um, jeans and pants. I don't wear a lot of pants but I wear jeans like crazy. So. And all of this stuff is not here because I have a load of laundry that's downstairs and I need to bring upstairs and put it in here. So yeah. Um, and then up here, I keep my workout stuff. <laughs> my workout stuff that I'm supposed to work in, yeah. All my leggings, which you know gets a lot of use right now because I'm working from home, so that's that there. And then here, um, I wanted to keep this area because my husband, um, if you want to know if you've been following me, I had, a, this used to be my home office. So I had wanted these stripes on the wall. So my husband painted these stripes for me. So I wanted to keep them um, open and exposed. So you can see the stripes though. That's why I did this here. This is, I forgot the name of it. You know, Ikea has these crazy names for everything. So, but I will um, list that below as well. So this is a dresser and the Ikea assistant kind of told me, it's like, you know, you don't have to use all of the regular drawers that goes with the system you can kind of just piece the stuff together so this is one of the dressers that he recommended that I get get and I got that so yes I did put this together by myself <laughs> um here's my sweet again this is me and him years ago I see that was 2002 I think that is um yeah so that's a boat ride we went on but I got this from Home goods as well, and they actually they still have these, so yeah. And I've got that from at home, along with the little moss balls there. And these fragrance, I don't know why anybody didn't tell me, but these candles from Pier One, and I'm sorry that they're going out of set, going out of business. They're amazing. I had burnt this candle so many times, and it still like has a lot of use left in it. So I wish I would have bought more when I got this one, but so. But anyway, let me continue. Um, this is another 39-inch um, pack system, wardrobe system, and this is where I keep all my dresses. This is all of the dresses that I own. I don't wear a lot of dresses. I like to kind of coordinate my outfit, so um, yeah, dresses are not a lot of what I wear. But let me show you all something. This was my idea. Ikea did not tell me to do this. I was like, I need some place to, to store my boots, and I don't have a lot of boots. Um, so I wanted to put them in here. So I added a pole. You can see that. I added a pole here. And then I have all my boots lined up behind there, which is pretty cool. And then I ordered these boot hangers, which is really cool. I'll link them below as well. Um, so you all, if anybody needs any boot hangers, they can get them. And then that's that. And then let's go over here. Um, this is another 39 inch unit um, where I keep, well, these are my socks. 
my socks and stuff here. I keep that in there. That's my fucking kind of stuff. But my socks, um, I got white socks and dark colored socks. Oh, no, I don't know, I'll say white socks and tights are up here. Um, here are all my blazers and jackets. Like I said, I like to do a lot of coordinating, so here's all my blazers and jackets there. So I can kind of hook up with my skirts and my pants and my jeans. So that's why I've got a lot of that, because like I said, I love to wear jeans. So let me go here. You know, yes, let me go here. I will tell you about this. I got this chair from Wayfair. Um, I absolutely love this chair. It's it's comfortable enough where like you're not gonna like fall asleep because I can't be falling asleep in this room because my husband will probably get a little bit upset if I like start sleeping in here. So I didn't want to get anything too comfy that I would fall asleep. So you know, it's just a nice little space for me to kind of come in, chill, pray, you know, just relax and you know just watch TV because I have my TV up there as well. So. <laughs> This is um, that, and then I got this little table from at home, um, and I thought it would go well with the runner that I have in here, because like the geometric um, pattern on the on the table, as well as it's on the rug, as well as it's on this wallpaper that I purchased about a year ago and never used it, and so I was like, you know what? When I was doing this, and it was after I started putting up the system. I was like, you know what? I want to use that wallpaper. So, put that wallpaper up after I got a couple of these units in, which was kind of hard to get around, but I made it. I made it work. Okay, so let's go to this unit, which is the 29-inch unit. Um, and with these pack systems, you guys, you can customize them any way you want to do it. I mean, like I'm telling you, it's so many ways that you could use these systems. Um, so I just added, like yesterday, just added these shelves in. So I hadn't had a chance to kind of plug the holes here. Where you see like I've plugged the holes on the rest of them and you can tell the difference. But I'm gonna do that a little later. So, But I wanted to get this filmed because I kept saying I was gonna do it and I haven't done it, So, but I'll plug those later. So here I keep my flats, um, some of my purses because I've got another whole box of purses, purses that I gotta kind of purge through. So, because I don't switch up my purses a lot, I wear, I, I carry my uh, Louis Vuitton Never Full all the time, so I really don't switch up a lot. But um, I kept some of my booties here, and this is my this up here is my amazing family. I love these people all so much. Um, that's my grandbaby. So I have to have two pictures of her. That's my grandbaby. That's my oldest son. That's my amazing daughter-in-law. This is my son Mark. That's Tehran. That's my amazing only daughter Jasmine. And that's my lovely son, Mr. Sean. So that's my family, guys. So I have to keep them in here for inspiration and keeps me going to know that what I'm doing is to make their lives better. So on to the next, which is another 39 inch. So I told you I have four 39 inch units in here. So this is um, the fourth one. And I just kind of wanted to do this half um, so I can hang my hoodies. I did not realize, I did not realize I have so many hoodies. And I have about like maybe five more downstairs in the laundry. <sighs> I didn't know it. But I love to wear hoodies around the house. Hoodies and leggings is what I do. So if you all see me, you know, with my um, sweatshirts on and stuff, and you think it's the same one, it's not. I have several. I have so many, especially enjoying my dash ones. I have so many sweatshirts. Um, and I'll give you, I'll post them who does my stress too. You gotta support my girl, I love her. So yeah, I got about like 20, 20, 25 sweatshirts, which is crazy. But so I have a section for that here. Um, this is the new design drawer that Ikea has with the, um, I forgot what they call it. I'll post it, I'll post it below, but I'm not, a, I don't remember the name, but it's a new design rather than just a, um, a flat surface they did like a cut a cut in for the drawer so I thought that was really cute so I wanted to order those and I did this is where I keep all my tees my t-shirts and stuff my other stuff is over there the unmentionables I'm not mentioning because they're in other drawers so you all don't need to see that but yeah it has the slow close I did that you guys I put that together again with these hands <laughs> but yeah so 
coming around here I've had this shelf forever um and I just repurposed it and I don't think I got it from Ikea but I don't remember where I got it so I just kind of put it more some more of my booties my tennis shoes and stuff just some odds and ends that I have over there um shameless plug this book I don't know if you all know that I am an author a published author uh, this is my book called that's not my name it's a kids book um, an anti-bullying series that I wrote and it's available on Amazon so put in that's not my name and then put in Anita Findle and you will find it and you can buy it yes I'm sorry okay I digress okay now let's go over here to where I have my shoes I've showed you all this before these are some amazing shoe boxes very sturdy I've had them for about like maybe three years now and they are the best they have the front load you can kind of take shoes out wear them put them back and then it's another thing that I do and I think I took it down there oh no so when I use my shoes after I put my before I put my shoes back in here I don't know if you want to do this but I spray the bottom of it because it's been outside in the nastiness so I don't want to just put it back in there so I spray the bottom of my shoes then I put them back just an idea so keep that there yeah so those are all my shoes and I'm not like a shoe crazy person so this is all of my so you will see my mirror here and it's not let me show you all something it's not just a mirror it's like oh but wait let me show y'all what this is it's an ironing board is this not cool you guys so our ironing board our washroom is all the way in the basement I don't have to go all the way to the basement anymore. This girl is getting old, okay? So, older. Um, so, I don't have to trudge all the way down to the basement to iron my stuff. I can just iron it here. And then just put it back up. Put it right back up. Close it in. And voila! I have my mirror again. And I keep my arm down in that cabinet down there. So, that is it, you guys. Let's see. Oh! But wait, I've got one more thing to show you all. So, I've always wanted a chandelier in my dressing room. So, um, let me show you what I have here. This is called a fandelier. Not a chandelier, but a fandelier. It's a fan and a chandelier. The blades are retractable, so that's why you don't see them now. But let me show you. And when I tell you all, this thing puts out a lot of air. I love it. Like sometimes it gets a little too cold. And then here's the light. And it has three different um, shades of light, like the LED, the white light, and all that. But my husband knows how to do it. I don't know how to do it yet. He's going to show me because I forgot. But anyway, it, it has three different shades of light. Um, so yeah, this is it, guys. This is it. That's all my where I keep my Uggs and, and yeah my actual Uggs are in there because this room is it collects a lot of dust so um, my actual Uggs are in those boxes my Louis Vuitton brush no it's not in there because I carry it all the time um, and th yeah that bag up there that's like an overnight bag got that from Walmart Walmart.com so yeah if you want a nice little bag go check out Walmart.com I haven't used it yet but it's a great bag um, oh over here let me show you this walk here it's my it's gonna be it's gonna it says dream but I'm gonna put big on there as well so I'm gonna have my vision board um, over there so I can once, once I do it again um, I will do a video on that because you all know the vision boards that we did in the vision boards that we did in uh, January they're obsolete now so I'm gonna redo mine and put it there so yeah that's it this is my dressing room, you guys. I hope you all love it, because I had so much fun doing it. So, just wanted to share it with you all, and if anyone has any questions on the pack system, on any pointers, and actually I'm gonna do a video on pointers, um, when putting your, your closet together, what I've learned and what may help you all as you put yours together, because it was just like so much fun. It was a lot of fun. It was really therapeutic, especially during the pandemic. 
Um, so it gave me something to do and keep my mind at ease. So yeah, I want to thank you all for hanging out with me and come on and have a cup of tea with me and my just home. I love you. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. Remember, like, comment, and subscribe.